Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm diving into the story of Charles Messier, the man behind one of the most famous astronomical catalogues ever made. And guess what? I'm about to start an exciting new journey, imaging every single image from that great catalogue. So please join me on this cosmic journey as we explore the history and intriguing detail of all the amazing Messier objects. My name's Glenn and you're watching Astrobloke. So, who was Charles Messier? Charles Messier was a French astronomer born in 1730 and he's best known for compiling the Messier catalogue which is a list of over 100 deep sky objects. But why did he make this catalogue? Well back in the day telescopes were not as advanced as they are today and spotting comets was quite difficult. In fact it was a real challenge and Messier kept coming across fuzzy objects in the sky and confusing them for comets. So to avoid the confusion he started to make a list and catalogue all of the fuzzy objects that were not comets so that they wouldn't be confused in the future. So his main goal was not only to help himself but other astronomers to differentiate between true comets and nebulae and star clusters. This way the comet hunters could focus on their true targets and not be distracted by the celestial imposters. As I mentioned, the catalogue's got about 110, well it has 110 objects in it. So how long did it take Messier to make this catalogue? Well let me tell you, it was not an overnight project and it actually took him about 20 years. He started compiling the catalogue in 1758 and the official completion wasn't until 1781 spending nearly two decades painstakingly observing, cataloguing and refining what we know today as the Messier catalogue. So fast forward today, the Messier catalogue is one of the most famous uh, references for amateur and professional astronomers around the world, including some really famous targets like the Orion Nebula, Andromeda Galaxy, the Whirlpool Galaxy. And now I am on a mission to photograph every single one of these celestial wonders. I do have some help though. I was recently contacted by a young astronomer from Switzerland, a young man called Julian who's just 15 and he had actually put together the Messier catalogue plus some other catalogues on the solar system and wanted me to have a look at them. He's put them out there available for people to purchase and he asked me if I would help him get them out to a wider audience. Now I think it's fantastic that the younger generation show an interest in these sorts of things and I'm more than enthusiastic about helping someone like that get into the hobby further and push out any work that they do. So when he showed me the Messier catalogue, immediately I thought, do you know what? I'd love to image this catalogue. Over the years, I've taken some pictures of the uh, Messier objects and I thought, wouldn't it be great to actually put the whole collection together? Now, I'm not the first person to do this. There's many people that have attempted this and have completed the catalogue and um, but uh, I've not done it myself and I thought what a great idea so thank you Julian for putting together the catalogue because it's made me have a goal which I want to complete so I'm going to be referencing Julian's work to help me pick every single one of those targets and take an image of it. So check out my links below to Julian's work I know he'd appreciate that support. Those links are also available on my Patreon page. There's links to that below as well. 
You can also watch all of my latest videos, including this one, ad-free, if you are a member of my Patreon, which also helps support my channel. I can't wait to use the catalogue to check out each of these amazing sites along the way and capture them. It is going to be quite an epic journey, hopefully not taking me 20 years, and I do hope that you'll come along for the adventure. My astronomy journey started in about 2019, seriously, when I started to take deep sky objects. So I've already captured some of the Messier targets, the more famous ones, shall we say. So luckily, I've got a little head start. So I'll be sharing some of those images with you now, and then keep an eye open for future videos where I will update you as I capture the rest of the targets. So hit that subscribe and like button and stay tuned for the journey ahead. Let's explore the universe one target at a time. Thanks for watching and I'll see you under the stars.